Uh, and then he got Machado, and I decided to go to Brad because it's probably the best matchup we got coming out of the bullpen so to try and end that inning right there. And unfortunately, a little slider got away from him. But by going to Brad there, it's a good matchup, but you risk if he doesn't get Cronenworth. How, how great of a risk is it? With the righties behind there. Yeah, I mean that's the three batter rule, but that's the rule, and you got to live with it. But um, but he, you know, he's had a lot of success, veteran guy. Um, I thought that was the right right guy to go to, even though that you've got Drury and Bell behind him. Drury's, I mean, Drury got the base hit. It wasn't really hit all that hard, and it looked like Bell didn't even know he hit the or like where he hit the ball. He just kind of inside out of it. Um, so anyway. Is. is that too early of a, for Alvarado there? Or? Yeah, yeah, especially pitching yesterday. Jake. Uh, at what point in the inning did you uh, start to get hand warmed up? Uh, probably on Soto. So was there was there any thought to having him ready for Soto? No, not at really. Not at that point. Not at that point, but once Soto tied it, then then we we're going to go. A few more for Rob, David. So what what do you what do you tell your team? Um, yeah, I mean, it's kind of similar to the last series, I guess. Exactly, and that's exactly what you tell them. We went into Atlanta, won the first one, um, lost the second one, disappointing game, and you know we had a day off and came back home in front of 46 thousand raucous people and, and played really well. So I expect to do the same thing. Matt. You have Suarez for game three. Yep. Your game four plan will it be similar. It's safe to assume it will be similar to what you did last year? Or yeah, do you think? it might be a different starter. But okay. We'll probably run the bullpen similar to what we did. Um, what was it? Game four and against Atlanta. And did you, uh, sorry, Nola, it was a couple 0-2 pitches in that inning. Uh, you kind of seen that before from him. Did What did you see on those? It was a pitch to Soto, and I think it was a pitch to uh, his brother, both 0-2 pitches that uh, ended up getting run scoring hits. Yeah, just mislocation is all I can, all I can say. Um, I haven't looked at the tape. I can tell you this honestly with the glare out there, a lot of times I couldn't even tell where it was thrown or what pitch it was. It was hard to see, but I'll have to look at the tape. But, I, you know, 0-2 pitches that are, that are barreled are probably mislocation. Any last ones for Rob? All right. See you in Philadelphia. See you in Philadelphia.